Alrighty, hello again, this is Trice Majestus, and we're back in Elite Dangerous Odyssey, back to exploring. Ah, cool, welcome back, Steve, uh, Shane. Shane Stevens, I gotta, I need glasses. <laughs> I can't read the monitor from here. Alright, welcome back, glad to see, glad to see you. Hi, Trace. Hey, Philip. And we've got uh, Shane in the in the chat. So hi, Shane. Right on at the beginning of the stream. That's cool. Yeah. All right, let's get things rolling here. Still not look on the bacteria. Not handle. I hit the landmark in uh, uncharted waters. Yeah, 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 Uncharted Waters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's all about elite. Yeah. Dangerous. System map. Uh, have you uh, uploaded a video though Bastion Way in a while? Oh, heck no. Okay. Because for some reason, it took me two hours and 50 minutes to upload a hour um, video that's only two hours and 20 minutes. And I don't understand how that happened. Because I didn't uh, raise any special settings that would cause such a thing. Your, your, your video uploaded was how long? Uh, two hours and 20 minutes. And it took you that how long? It, it took me just under three hours. It should have took me just over one hour. No. It yeah, actually put... No, Philip, that's not how it works. It actually takes me half the time to upload than the video uh, <sighs> would play. But, but this time it took more. Well, I've never had it take less than the time the video had been played. The play time of the video. Oh, I always had. Well, goody for you. Well, if you used to be, if the last time you did a video you were used to 770, maybe that was why? No, because of it, uploading the video does not go through the video card. It goes just straight over the internet. It took me half the time to upload that the video uh, plays. Well, maybe there were network delays. Mm. It would probably take me less time now than it did then because I've got better internet, but... Yeah, I live right next to a tower. I basically steal their internet. Rip it right off the tower. Insane speeds. Where's my? There it is. Uh, I need my elbow brace. There. All right. Let's. Uh... Head off to the last planet in the system, go find its bio, and then uh, I think I'm actually going to pop back to the carrier. Oh, okay. Well, but I want... you can't even drop off your data there, right? What do you mean? I can't drop. I can... well, I can no. Think about it. I've got far more than Odyssey data in here. I've been scanning these systems from scratch. Yeah, but but can you uh, give? Oh, okay. Oh, okay, so you're going to dump that. Okay. Yeah, I'll still have the on foot data, that, you know, on my ship, yeah. but I should put, I'll be able to drop off enough so that I'll have my full 400 arcs for the week. Mm. Because you don't get the full value of what you do exploring until you actually sell it. Oh, okay. Come to think of it, you probably do get some arcs by landing on planets. You might I not get credits, but you probably get a benefit from arcs. 
I have 38 arcs or something like that total oh, for the whole week. Uh, so it's not a dot. But it's, it's more than the trivial. credits you get, that's for sure. No. You get zero credits for landing on planet. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I don't know that you get it. I don't know that you get any arcs for landing on the planet. Planets. I'm oh, I'm okay. getting it just basically for all total for everything I've done this week, right? Scanning, yeah. landing, getting bios. I've got like 38 or 48 arcs total out oh, of the 400. Okay. I mean, it's almost nothing. <laughs> the real money comes in when you turn it in. Well, that mean you know that just means that you know you're missing out on a bunch of arcs if you had your a carrier with you. Well, you're still capped at 400 a week, so. Yeah, but you get less than a hundred a week unless you actually sell some. Mm. Oh, this is a lousy area to look. It's too dark here. I'm starting to think I should go to the dark side. Yeah, I'm thinking I definitely went to the wrong side of the planet. I'm heading directly into the sun. Oh, wait, maybe if I turn this way, the glare won't kill me. Yeah, that's a little better. What, you don't have a special sunglasses? <laughs> yeah, uh, you're funny, UV, Philip. You be uh, 80,000 or something? <laughs> Not on the windscreen and all the glare off the ground. You can't see if there's anything there. Oop, is that a... Or is that just shadow? It's hard to tell with this. No, it's just a shadow. Okay. This spot looks big enough for my ship. As well. I'm going to... The whole planet's blue, so I mean... It really doesn't matter where I land. Mm -hmm. I'm landing in places that are slightly more green than others, but that's not doing anything to me, so... I should uh, drink. go live. Oh, damn, you weren't live? Oh, in Discord. You in Discord, in yeah. Discord. Okay, yeah. I'm like, then I remember. Wait, Shane was in the chat. You had to be live. Yeah. Uh, you mean the Discord? Yeah, I put it up on Discord too. Just And you're, uh, I'm getting uh, my yeah, own yeah, voice yeah. back at me. All right, there we go. So, you know, now I just get to buzz along the planet here, and hopefully I'll see the, uh, whatever bacteria happens to be here. <laughs> I'm not sure. What, bacteria? Yeah. Oh, that might be Come bacteria. Nope, that's not bacteria, that's a shadow. It's gonna be wonderful tonight, huh? Yeah. Yeah, you know, once I end up somewhere where I see one, I'll probably see a few, but... Yeah, tell that to this planet. I found one sample, and there were no other samples anywhere. Well, that's rough. So at least I know what they look like. Hmm. Well, I don't even know that yet because I haven't seen the first one. Oh, what's that over there? 
Is that something, or is that just a shadow? Must have been just a shadow. There we go. Deploy landing gear. Landing gear deployed. Ooh, a new one. Landing gear deployed. Bacterium Bularis Cobalt. That's another high price one. have to put my name on the galaxy map. There it is. First football. Yay. Planet that has it has four the next planet. Mm -hmm. So there will be at least one bio on there that I haven't seen yet in this system. All right, one more bio to go, or one more bacteria to go. Uh, gotta get some distance first. Complete. All right, now let's go turn in our data for the week before we forget. 
system, uh, galaxy map. Galaxy map. Here's the galaxy map, Commander. Track landing here. Landing here. There's the land spot. So do. Engage. Charging FDL. Nobody found you guys. <laughs> Looking for you. Uh, stealthily friend. Red room! Red room! Can I see my friend? Red room! Here's Johnny. Yeah. That's, <laughs> that's what I'm afraid of. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not the one stalking the bacteria, the bacteria is stalking me. Yeah, I'm just worried that at some point we find triffids. Oh, you didn't see that movie. No. Oh, triffids are carnivorous plants. Oh, okay. It's an old, old horror movie from back in the 70s. Actually, there was a couple of them, I think. I think it was R Rise of the Triffids and Revenge of the Triffids or something like that. Um, oh, yeah. What are they like? A smaller versions of uh, uh, Little Shop of Pirates or something? Uh, if memory serves, they were six foot plus tall. Oh, shit. Okay. Um, Things that kind of look like, you know, long grassy stems with a bulbous thing on top. And I don't remember how they killed you. Uh, far too many years ago. They probably sucked the water out of your blood or something. I don't know, I forget. But it was just like, yeah, they kill you. So 
took a while for people to figure out what was killing everyone because they yeah they just plants right well no they'd stay <laughs> immobile during the day oh okay they only moved at night initially mm. if my memory serves and but you know given how many years ago this was um my memory may be um ridiculously wrong <laughs> I don't. Re I don't even remember how the movie ends. I no. No idea. Wait. Now I have dust cloud. Seriously, game. <laughs> like the fact here is not hard enough to find. Disengage. Leaving hyperspace. They're like tumbleweeds, except they're just dust. Mm -hmm. well, we're not the flat spot, too, where the bacteria would be. Open hailing frequencies. In the back Requesting here, docking permission. Out of the way. A landing pad has been assigned to you. Oh, there it is. Let's sell some astronomical data. Universal cardiographics. Let's see. Oh, wait. Before I do this, I have... Oh, it's my pencil. I have... 5,796... Five billion seven hundred ninety six million thirty three thousand eight hundred and forty eight credits. All right, now let's sell stuff. Five million. Whoops, wrong button. No, oh, I only have one page. 5,563,177 credits for a week. Does that make sense? You, you weren't uh, really exploring many systems. Nope. nope. And 532,500 credits of bonus. Mm. Not bad. Not 
bad. But that'll care better be worth a lot. <laughs> All right. I can't wait till I have services so that after a long run like this, I can go to the bar. <laughs> Too bad you can't actually order drinks at the bar. Yeah, I know. That would be funny to actually be able to drink something at the bar. Yeah. I don't know why, but all these... All these uh, simulation type games always seem to screw up the food aspect of the sim somewhat. It's <laughs> weird. It's like a weird galaxy omission. Map. Here's the galaxy map, Commander. Like, All right, uh, where do I go this time? No, oh, been there. Okay. System you haven't been to. Yep. Well, I've been to that one. Let's see. What's in here anyway? Oh, well, I've been there, but um, nobody's got first footfall. Any bio? Oh, it won't you... tell me because the last time I was, I was there was before Odyssey. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> I have three landable planets, okay? Oh, that's it? That's yeah. a small system. Yeah, or... it's got th yeah, three landable, three not. Or four not. Yeah. Okay, yeah, it's a small system. And I haven't mapped any of them, so... I've been there, but I have uh, did a honk and go because it's got no... Uh, rings. No rings, yeah. So, I think that was the right one, yeah. All right, so I guess I'll go there anyway, because I can map stuff. Would, wait a second. You would think this far into the future, we would be able to narrow narrow down the life signs more than what they are. Mm. We, we don't even narrow it down, basically. We just say, uh... This is the type of ground that this life form may grow on. We don't know where it is, though. Well, it is what it is. We're track landing here.
system map. Oh, wow. It's a whole string of high metal content worlds. Ooh. That's good. One's terraformable. Ooh. Two's terraformable. No one mapped them? Well, they've been mapped. I won't get oh, first map just on them. Oh, by you. Okay. Hmm. So I got three landable and two terraformable. Nice. Hello, Hans! But no one mapped on those? You can't well, land on a terraformable. Yeah, you can. No, you can't. There are terraformables well, that are landable. Well, well, I haven't seen any. Uh, no, I logged on just fine, Hans. And welcome back. I logged on just fine too, although something weird happened with my ship when I first landed. He's been uh, getting orange sidewinders for 20 hours. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, there was like this weird delay that seemed like it froze me. Like the game didn't process something properly when landing. Hmm. And then like 10 seconds later, all of a sudden my landing gear is engaged. Uh, lock, on, lock on to the ground. Hmm. So. I don't know. There's no, something weird is going on. I would say may maybe it was because I uploaded the video, except that finished over an hour, hour before I went on to elite, so... Well, you said it took twice as long as normal. Maybe your internet yeah. service is not what you think it is at the moment. Everything else seems fine. Well, do a, do a, use a speed test. Forget how to do that. Google it. No, if anything, that should make it make it better. What? I think you just got a much better Service video card. Oh, scan complete. Hmm. System map. I just activated the uh, PS counter I uh, discovered by accident uh, the other day, and I'm. It says I'm locked at 75, so who knows what was going on before. No idea. Oh, there's no bios in this system. Still a bunch That's of high. Good. People Still. are always saying on foot, it's all unstable. I'm, I'm moving the camera around and everything. And it's well, you've got out. you've got a 70, you have 75 megabit in internet. I mean. Yeah. Come on. Or <laughs> That's better than 90% of the people in the United States yeah, have. That's true. Yeah. Hell, that's better than I've got. I only got 50. Oh, yeah. And I got to pay through the nose for that. Mm. Orbital flight engaged. All right. So, we're going to get our first footfalls on the three planets I can. And scan everything and then move on to the next system.
deploy landing gear. Landing gear deployed. Put in my name on the map, put in my name on the map, put in my name on the map. You narcissist, narcissism, <laughs> narcissistic, or whatever. Who, me? Yes. yes. <laughs> System map. Retract landing gear. Landing gear is my Really all the way over there, over a mountain and through the woods. <laughs> <laughs> there aren't any woods. What are you talking about? <coughs> There's so over the I'm bacteria and through the fungoids, maybe. I'm surprised there aren't woods. I'm Listen not. How much, how much grass there is over here? Yeah, I'm like, this must be the most Brazilian grass ever to grass, in the universe. Grass is far more resilient than trees. Come on. Yeah, yeah. No, I know that. But... Yeah, why are you surprised then? Trees, you can't get trees unless you're in a full atmospheric planet, which we can't land on yet. I did land on one that had a heavier atmosphere. Not, but not heavy enough for trees. Probably not. You need a full atmosphere, not a fractional atmosphere. And we can't even land on a point three right now. Mm. So, no trees. Not yet. Science doesn't support it. here that I'm not finding. Because I found the first sample, so I know, no, I know there's no bug or something.
I picked a lousy place to come down. <laughs> No, I'm in a mountain range. Let's see if I can land on this shelf. Footfall, get back in the ship. System map. Alright, the next three are not landable. Okay. Retract landing gear. Landing gear retract. Before I sneezed. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Keep those planets rolling. Rawhide. It's probably down there. Oh, if the cliffs were just a little bit higher, this would be a great place for uh, for uh, a racing. The, the wetness of these. But uh, canyon walls aren't that high. Mm. Canyon running, the wall's got to be at least a mile high, mile high yeah. for the ships we're using, yeah. and they're not. They're so rarely that. 
when you do find one that's there's so big, they're they're either too wide or too there's short. only one cliff side, mm -hmm. and it's not a canyon. So or they're too the, short. <laughs> yeah, <coughs> yeah, too short. It's the uh, the most common issue. Not too shallow is the most common issue now. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah, when you said too short, I was thinking the cliff's height. Oh, uh, no, not it's the... the length. Yeah, yeah they, no. they gotta be fairly, you know, fairly yeah. long, fairly narrow, well, and quite deep. this is long enough. This is definitely long enough. But one of the cliff sides is so short it's not even funny another mm -hmm. one's uh if it were like 50 more feet it might Service actually scan work scan. you would have to System fly map. fairly low We have a bacteria! Bacteria, Aureus, and I didn't see the last part. Went away. Lime. Need one more sample. System map. <coughs> oh crap. Took me over an hour to get that.
dumping bacteria. Still looking for that same bacteria? Oh, no, I found, <coughs> I found the second sample. Oh well, yeah, you should be done with that by now. I've yeah, completed, I've completed a bacteria, and I'm almost completed the next whole system. Yeah, you don't get it. There's like one sample per quarter of a planet. Oh, I doubt it, that. It's that bad. And I'm not even trying hard here. They have to cut their patch over there. That might be a bacteria, although it's lighter than it should be. Surface scanned by 50%. No. Nope. That's a pile of rubble. System map. How are you going? How are you looking at for it, Philip? Are you in your ship? Or are you in the SRV? Foot. On foot? Well, oh God, get foot! Get in your ship! You're, you're not going to be able to see this bacteria in the ship. Sure you are. And I'm not going to point a small cursor at every little piece of ground in hopes it beeps. You just look. That's, at... that's insane. At least, least on foot I got a pulse scanner. Learn how to recognize the patterns in the ground, Philip. Otherwise, yeah. you're just going to take forever. Because you can see them from the ship. Even the, even the most difficult ones, you can still see from the ship. You just have to learn what you're looking for, train your eyes so that you can see what's there. Otherwise, you just take forever running around a planet. Because, I mean, in some cases, you know, the samples are a couple kilometers apart. So if you're running around on foot, you'll run right between them and won't see the one on your right or left. Because they're too far away. That's why you're having so much trouble and taking so long. Learn how to find them from the ship. Up and finding them. Yeah, but in the time it takes you to find one. No, I usually I I completed the entire planet with like three to four bios in like ten to fifteen minutes before. Mm-hmm. Which is still slow. You can do better than that. Learn how to spot them from a ship. It makes it a whole lot easier. And, and you're still going to have to get out somehow. Sure. You go land right next to it, get out, scan it, hop right back in. <laughs> that's, that's, you made a bunny there. What? That's what I've been doing. You, you don't always get an option to land anywhere near it. Well, no. Sometimes it takes a little bit. I'll try to find it, depending on how far you have to go to find it landing spot. Yeah, so it's still faster. Surface scanned by 50%. Surface scan complete.
Ah, Anthony's online. Mr. Burnt Beans. He's gone offline. Probably be able to see if it's spotted. <laughs> like, nope, out of here. Jeez. Really, there was only one bacteria in this entire canyon? Yeah. Some of them are like that. Deploy landing gear. Landing gear deployed. That's why you use a ship. All right. System map. We can program our own AI for the ship. And it's facing the wrong way, too.
Yeah, mule. Let's get on over there. <laughs> 3,500 light seconds between planets. Oh. Take a couple minutes to get there. Captain Crazy Glue. Looks like Hans is coming on. Is that Hans or is that? Yeah, that's Hans. Galaxy map. Here's the galaxy map, Commander. All right, let's pick another system. Maybe if we go down a little bit. What's down? Haven't been there. I'll go there. Sure. Engage. Preparing to form space.
Hmm. So? No bios or geos in the entire system. <laughs> System map. And only one landable. That's a born system. Well, maybe. There's no high value planets. Right? Oh, yeah, there are. Oh, uh, there are. Two. Three, four, All five, five terraformables. Oh, wow. Okay. Damn. Five terraformables on a, uh, what a one, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, on ten planets, five are terraformable. Wow. <laughs> one is landable. The terraformable one? No, no, no. Oh, one okay. of the little ice balls. But, um... Oh, yeah, somebody came through and, uh... Got first mapping on all the terraformables. Oh, not all of them. Oh, no, that one's not terraformable. Oh. Well, maybe the thing wasn't updating. Never mind, let me go back to the beginning here. Okay, that's just normal. That's... That's terraformable. That's landable. That's terraformable. So two, three. Okay, three terraformables. That's what do still. You mean three? How do you go from five to three? Uh, because the text didn't update. Oh, uh, yeah. That's a bit of a bummer, Hans. He's got one account that works and one that doesn't. Why? What happened? Well, apparently there's some crazy bug. Broken, eh. broken the entire account? Oh, a bunch of people's accounts. Oh, shit. That's a very bad bug. There's a bunch of people who, every time they try and log in, get an orange sidewinder and complaining about it on the forums. Yep. I, I heard about that, but I thought it was fixed. Well, I thought they would have fixed Oh, damn. I didn't realize it was the long... Oh, shit. That sucks. <laughs> Sorry to hear that, Hans. File. I don't want to have only one sample per night for three nights. <laughs> God damn it.
Good evening. Good evening. Kind of lonely out here tonight. Where is everybody? Uh, Lynn's tired from uh, gardening. Um, haven't Cam is working. Cam is working. Haven't oh, yeah, seen. Keep... Yeah. I'm not used to hearing that phrase. <laughs> Um, I haven't seen Carl in ages. Yeah. Or Chris. Or Chris. I don't get it. Chris used to play, like, almost as much as Lynn. And now well, he's, like, never on all of a sudden. Something happened in real life, and he can't oh, come. Yeah. So, oh, I, I, that's what I'm guessing. Oh, uh, well. Because he re he really enjoyed the game, so the only reason he would have left yeah. is if there's something going on in real life. Yeah, that's so. true. I gotta remember where I was. <laughs> it's been so long. It's been about two weeks since I logged into this account. Wow. Got to tell Tony to get off his ass. I'm, I'm almost at 15 million. <laughs> that was the bet for the starter account. I think I'm going to get a carrier on this account and then play the other one and jump to my carrier. Hmm. <laughs> I'll have both accounts on the same carrier. Might as well. God, I forgot how much money I have. It's been so long. Let's see here. Uh, seven and a half billion, so I'm getting there. Getting there, yep. I think nine will do it. What do you think, Chris? Hold out for ten or... I, I'll never hold off for 12. I, I don't have that kind of patience. <laughs> I would hold on for as much patience as you've got just so that you can afford the tritium to keep to, and uh, the upkeep costs. Yeah. Or you could spend two months mining it, mining it yourself. I like to mine. Oh, um, okay. There you go. Then. Peace and quiet. Yeah. Yeah, but you got you got to worry about you know it's like twenty six uh, k a week. Yeah. Yeah. What? You mean twenty six mil? Yeah, twenty six mil a week. Yeah. 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 But that's easy to get. Pretty much anything you're gonna do these days, you're gonna make like a hundred ish mil a week. Yeah. So there's basically a month with the upkeep. What platform are you on, Shane? Have you had a carrier before, Phil? have enough for a carrier. I have like 8.7 bill. Keep going. Just yeah. haven't pulled the trigger yet. Yeah, you, you keep going, Phil. <laughs> yeah. It's not enough. <laughs> one, one more CG might do it. One more decent CG, that is. Yeah, PC. Okay. What What's your commander's name? If we could solve that nobody to play with the problem. Yep. Sure. Okay, give me just a second and put the ship down here. So I'm guessing he, he is on PC then? Yep. Deploy landing gear. Landing gear deployed. This is a PVE group. Yeah, we do, I don't. <laughs> yeah, we, do, we don't condone blowing each other up. It's just not. We just don't do that. Um, occasionally, it, 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 it uh, it's not even that. It's just a, it costs too much. You know, you've, you've always got something going on where um,
Active three days ago. Who? Kanesh, who is Shane. Oh, okay. All right, so now I need to step out and get my first footfall. So I sent you an invite, Kanesh, or Steve, and I also invited you to the private group. We've got a bunch of people who play at various hours of the day. Um, so it's... Uh, need people to play with? Well, <laughs> we can play. <laughs> System map. System map. Cool, and we'll see you in game this weekend. Oh, cool. Can't see you. No, he's still he, he's still watching. He just can't play oh, right now. Yeah, yeah. Retract landing gear. Landing gear retract. Now I'm certainly willing to invite people into the group, just as so long as we stay PVE. We're good. Although we've had a few accidents yeah. already. <laughs> so called accident. It always ends up being one person, one very specific person that ends up getting killed. No well, that, that's because she hangs around with Cam and Chris. Chris neither, yeah. neither one of which has very good trigger uh, control. Trigger discipline. Trigger discipline. Um. And the only time that I ended up coming close to killing her was back before they had the friend foe designation yeah. working. And I thought she back when Nanda she was like was it still in Alpha actually? No, nah, it was just after Alpha. Uh, oh, okay. But uh yeah, the friend foe designation wasn't working and uh, I thought she was one of the scavengers. <laughs> so I turned around and shot at her. <laughs> and she, you know, that, you know, luckily, we, you know, we were on, uh, you know, community. You didn't want to waste ammo. Uh. So you didn't just empty, <laughs> empty your weapon out. Well, no, I use plasma, so I only get one shot at a time. Oh, so. okay. Um, so, uh, you know, I took I took a shot, and she went, whoa! It's like, oh, oh that's you over there, sorry! <laughs> of course, I could, can't, couldn't hit the right side of the barn at that time, but... Uh, it was it was good for a laugh or two, um, but I've never intentionally shot at anybody. And you know, Cam and Chris, um, they don't intentionally shoot at anybody, but they're like I said, their tri their trigger discipline isn't that great. They don't always do a good job even with the friend foe designator up Which too. You, you would think by now Chris would be because he's like godly in uh, combat. You would think he would he's, have control. Well no, he's he go, he's godly as a solo where he doesn't have to worry about friend foe designation. Yeah. And then there's Cam, who's just a, you know... Yeah, he's a, he's a glass can, a uh, wild cannon. Well, no, he's, he'll shoot near you. Too near you. Um, <laughs> you know, he'll shoot over your shoulder to get the guy in front of you, but if you move, you may move right into his shot. Um, he needs to practice on getting better angles on that. <laughs> So or just don't shoot over shoot somebody's shoulder. <laughs> yeah. But the combat zones are not really great for um, learning that type of skill because um, you end up... Right yeah. 
Yeah, I mean, it's all NPCs. You don't have to worry too much about friend-foe designation system map. And so you're just going around, shoot, 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 shoot. It's the shooting gallery. Uh, and it's, yeah, literally. But, you know, it is what it is. This system's worth more than anything, than all of the systems put together for the whole week. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. I kept finding pretty bad systems. I found lots and lots of icy worlds. Yeah. And no, nothing terraformable. Well, you are at the far end of the world. That, 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 no, that has nothing to do with it. There's plenty of them out here. System map. Some of these I'm going to get first mapped on. Not the terraformables, but uh, the other ones. Hey, Tamborello, welcome back. Yeah, hi, Tamborello. Welcome back. Well, <coughs> I'd have to call him F1 since he's an F1 fan. <laughs>
<laughs> he, he liked my little comment. <laughs> Nah, my dad used to watch it all the time when I was a kid. I couldn't see them. It just wasn't, you know, I'm not into car racing. Well, unless I'm the one racing. Yeah. Well, well, you have to be into car if you're the one racing. <laughs> bad things happen. There's a, um, just look, down in south of Boston, there's a uh, place called F1 Boston. It's a quarter, quarter scale F1 racing. Where you can go in and you can race. Did that once. It was fun. It's, it's a place like that in New Jersey as well. Well, there's a whole circuit of them. Um, so the local one for Boston is F1 Boston. And you know, a company I was at year, a bunch of years ago, we uh, had a, uh, the group I was in at the company had a, had a corporate outing there. And so the company paid for us to race. <laughs> All but one of us, poor Steve. Steve was too big, he couldn't fit in the suit. Oh man, really? Tough break. Yeah, well, I don't think the car would have moved with him, but... <laughs> and it's not that he was, you know, overweight or anything. The guy was almost seven feet tall and built. Oh, okay. So he, he couldn't... He couldn't really sit in, in there to begin with. Yeah, he would have had a hard time not having his knees bump against the steering wheel. Um, not only that, he was probably over the weight for the car. System map. Because they were... Uh, they were miniature ones, right? Slimmed down. Quarter scale. Yeah, quarter scale. Overpowered go-karts. Yep. Um, they do 45 miles an hour, two inches off the ground. Hey, Kenny, welcome back. Hi, Kenny. Yeah, that can be, it can get to be a really expensive hobby. I, I oh yeah, yeah. People spend hundreds of thousands of dollars on the quarter scale. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I know. It's, it's crazy. I know. <laughs> <clears throat> well, some of them um, they show off and they get sponsored. So an ad, com, you know, company, <laughs> same as same as any other pro racing, you get sponsored, you slap stickers on the car, and uh, you know the ones that are serious about it have their own cars. Naturally. But we were playing with just the house cars, and all but one of them were pretty good. Yeah, like I said, all but one were pretty good. Yep. One of them could barely get out of its own way. <laughs> uh, that's that's the that's the one you bring you you give the friend you don't really like. <laughs> You're like, let's go to the track and you give him the shot. Well, it was funny. One, one, you know, we had to, we had three three different um, times out on the track, and they averaged them for things. The first time, I got the fast, fastest car on the track. The second time, I got a reasonably good car, and the third time, I got that one that just blew everything out of proportion because it just couldn't get out of its own way. supposed to get three laps around well i got lapped twice by everybody oh my lord it was that slow it was that it was horrible um 
you know, in a decent car, I'd get my full, you know. Okay. If it was that slow, how, how, how come they let it on the track in, in the first place? Because they needed a certain number of cars for the number of people we had, and they ran out of the ones that were all fixed. So we had one crappy car. Just pointing out that system map that, could, that had to be uh, outside it, of regulations or something. Regulations? No, there's no there's no reg for a for a private race. That wasn't a it wasn't a league race. That was you know it was a corporate outing where we went to go spin around the cr the track a bunch of ta times. Oh, okay. um, it wasn't like one of those uh, circuits and stuff you were talking about? No, hell oh, heck no. They, okay. I mean, they don't survive on the circuits alone. They do company outings. Um, they've got local races. People play for private track time to, uh, you know, the pro racers oh. buy, buy track time. There's multiple tracks in the building, too. It was um, quite a bit of fun, actually, especially, oops. Especially, when, you know, the two times that I didn't have the crap car. Um, <laughs> hey, Anthony. Hey, what's going on? Hi, Anthony. I, I, th I thought I spelled some uh, beans that had been left on too long. Yeah. Burnt beans in the house. <laughs> oh, there's nothing worse to try and clean out of a pot than burnt baked beans. Yeah. And that night I sprayed some air And if it's it a glass worse. pot, that's where it's baked into it. No, it was a metal pot baked into that. <laughs> they call Pleasure. it a Hey! <laughs> they call it a non-stick pan, but I think yeah. that's wrong. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that's bad for you anyway, that stuff. Baked beans, it's wonderful for you. No, baked beans is good. It's eating that Teflon ain't good. Yeah, oh, that's true. Beans and Teflon. <laughs> Cast iron or ceramic? That's the only way I go. <laughs> no, that's right. Ceramic's good, except they usually have the rims at the top that are uh, that are metal, and they rust. That the lid fits in? No, no. Yeah. Mine don't. I'm talking about big old bean pots and stuff. Yeah. And the high-end ceramic pots don't have that metal rim. Oh, Since we're talking about beans. <laughs> beans! Beans! Dogs and weenies. Uh, weenies, weenies and beanies. Yeah. Hey, uh, Tony, you in game? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which account? Beans! Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> Burnt beans. <laughs> uh, are, are you? Yeah. Yeah, that's its name. Because I, uh, I haven't been able to log in since, I don't know, about 20 hours now. What? In, uh, oh. in, uh... Horizons in my second right. account, the one I've been playing with you uh, in the starter zone. Won't let me. You look oh, all man. over, you look all over the forums, they're having all kinds of problems. I, I logged oh. into my second account, my oh. main account, uh, rather, my primary account. In, oh, in, in Horizons. But, That's weird. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. I might try it again to see, but... You got me beat, though, still. I ain't number four million. <laughs> oh, jeez, I'm about... I, I forget what I'm at, but I'm I'm up there. No. I'm over I'm over 12, anyway. Yeah. Might be, might be closer. Might be more. 17, I, I'm I, getting... Uh, once I reach 17, I'm over. I'm getting out of here. And oh, now it's 17? What happened to 15? 17. That'll be fine. Oh, 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 he's changing the rules of the game. What are you going to do with 17? There's nothing Go buy a carrier. <laughs> no. Carrier doesn't cost anywhere near that. Million, 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 17 oh. million. I'm broke. Oh, <laughs> oh I, I thought there was a B. No, million. Hey, hey, look, if you could make 17 billion in a new player sector, my, my head comes off to you. I ain't gonna lie to you. 
<laughs> it means you've been playing a long yeah, time. Yeah, you've been playing five years. <laughs> you'd be like the person who took a sidewinder out in the Hey, That is punishment. Like, nobody's <laughs> this. <laughs> oh, Supposedly, there's people in the starter zone that have, have never left, been playing for years. Yeah, I know. Supposedly, I, I don't know. How well, they can't have been play. playing for too many years because the starter yeah. zone hasn't been there that long. It's been there. there. It, but that, well, but it's been a year and a half. Some, yeah, some people have been in here since it started. That's funny. And they won't leave because it's the only place you can play in open and you won't get ganked. Right. But, but you might as well not play, you know, hey. to begin with. Well, that here's the no thing. Sense. They can enjoy. Some people like gameplay, Philip. That just likes to just play, but, but, not but get the killed. Is limited. Yeah. So. And they want it, and they want to meet other people. Right. Well, I've so had a blast. I mean, yeah. I've learned. I've learned more stuff that I forgot. You yeah. know, miss, missions that like I wouldn't take in the starter zone when I was so new. I was a, a you know, assassination mission. Well, hell, no way. I'm try I'm ready for that yet. You know. And now yeah. in the, in the main account, <laughs> I got so much stuff I don't want to lose my you know, right? My two hundred million dollar <laughs> from Anaconda. Exactly. So no, I I can see why people do it. I'm glad you mentioned it. I, I was having a blast. Yeah. The new player zone is a great place for open. It's a. And I'll tell you what, we we ain't the only older players in there right now. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, I, I you can tell who's who just by the way they act, you know. Yeah. <laughs> right. System map. That's why I wish we would have uh had made it so like the game New Horizons. I wish they would have made it like that. In what way? New Horizons uh uh not New Horizons, I'm sorry. New World. Oh, okay. In New World, when you were at the colonies, like the little towns, mm hmm in the towns, you can choose, only in the towns, you can choose to be open in PvE, or you can choose to be v PvP. Mm -hmm. Only in the towns you can do that. You can switch it. You okay. can't switch it once you leave town. If, uh, if you were to do that in Elite Dangerous Equivalent, you would be, as long as you're in a station, you could change your status from PvE to PvP if you wanted to. Huh, but you okay. don't have to, you don't have to come out of open. You can stay in open. Right. Once you leave out the station, you're in, in whatever PvE, mode, right? Yeah, in PVE, you're stuck there unless you land back on a station and change it. Right. And as long as you're out in space, you can just be PVE means. And then well, how would they do that in Elite? Well, it'll be like all your weapons is like friendly fire. In other mm. words, it won't destroy your shields. It won't do nothing to you. Right. And interdictors wouldn't work on you. If right. it was a player trying to interdict me, your your interdictor wouldn't work on me, Trice, nor would your weapons be able to take down my shields at all. Right. That's the way it would be PvE. But NPCs could do it. Right. And uh, and I could still fight NP NPCs. We could all do co-op, but we couldn't fight each other. Right. Okay. That makes sense. Well, Tamborello, some people like that type of play. Others don't. Yes. Don't, it's a lot of people in here that don't like combat, mm -hmm. that play space games. Some of them, yep. you, some people like utilities, like uh, you just a trader going from place to place trading. And like I said, I have met a lot of people that don't like combat inside these space. They love space games, but they don't like combat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, combat's my least favorite part of space games too. Yeah, it is. I, now, don't get me wrong. I can hang with the best. Yeah. <laughs> In combat, but I don't prefer combat at all. Yeah. And when you went, and we, and then you want to play it, everybody say, well, if you don't like it, you can play in private. Yeah, but you don't meet nobody new in private, and you don't meet nobody in solo. Right. You know, when you're in open, you can meet people you ain't never met before. You can talk to people you ain't never seen before. Yeah. You can just meet all kinds of people. Just right. wish uh, this game's uh, safe maps weren't so limited. I wish it was like uh, Uncharted, where there's a smaller bubble within the bubble that are just not allowed to have combat in it. 
for a uh, player versus player combat, and that's it. Why? Why do you have to restrict it to to a few systems? And once you leave, you're you're out. Oh, the yeah. new player area? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. yeah. Nobody wants a certain like said, radius from Seoul. There's an equal amount of people who lacks no no combat. There's a lot of people. There's there's not a vast number of gankers, but even the little bit they got is enough to just yeah, kill everybody's day. Oh it's so annoying. Yeah. You fly around in an unarmed, unnothing sidewind, and somebody go against you for Federal Four Vet, armed to the teeth, and they just yeah. blow you up for no reason. You ain't got nothing to take from them. You're yeah. doing it just to ruin a person's day. That's all yep. you're doing it for. You're not doing it for any other reason. You ain't gonna it's tell me you're doing it for any other reason. And they do that around uh, the engineers too, like yeah. especially mm -hmm. uh, and around every CG. Yep. Yeah. And you're doing it just to piss people off. You're not yeah. doing it for any kind of gameplay. It's just, yeah. to, it's just to, just to piss you off. Yep. And they, and you know they're on the other end just laughing about it. Yeah. Cannot comply. But yet, when the little, uh, exploited, what, uh, salvage weapons came out, and they were so busy trying to kill people like they always do, and then they started getting killed, it's then they found out that they were the punks, they were the one that was starting the combat log and all that stuff. It yeah. shows you they have no integrity, none at all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anyway, um... Okay, there you go. The, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Anthony's stepping down off the soapbox. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty, well, I'm out of time for the night. Uh, it is a work night, and uh, so I got to get up in the morning and uh, do the stuff I get paid to do. So... You mean sleep at your desk? <laughs> no, just kidding. You. <laughs> He's probably He's right. Got... He's got people for that. What are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, I, I, I'm the guy that everything gets handed to so that other people can sleep yeah. at their desks. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. That, that's right. Yeah. That's about right. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to my world. Yeah. Actually, we, we don't have very many people who are uh, desk snappers. Uh -huh. um, yeah, he fired good. them a long time ago. <laughs> No, well, they I they promoted mean, all of them. No, I'm gonna, not going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> it's the truth, though. Oh. It's for people who always get the promotions. Yeah, that's true. Anyway. Um, <laughs> Go ahead. Actually, right now on the project I'm at, I've got a pretty good team. But anyway, I do need to get to bed, so... Uh, I'd like to thank everyone who came along for the ride this evening. It was great having you all along. Shane, thank you for joining us. Great to have you. Hope you'll be coming back. And let's see. And actually see you this uh, this weekend in game. Uh, Tamborello, thank you for coming back. Glad to see you. Kenny, welcome back. Um, and I guess that's everybody in the stream who isn't also over here in the voice so anthony hans and philip thank you for joining me in the um voice chats great having you guys along as always so that's uh, all we have time for tonight we'll pick this up again tomorrow night 8 p.m eastern time that's all for now this is terrace majestus signing out good night Good night.